Oh, hi there, Team Ozone. So, uh, in between recording this episode and Storm 16, well, 116, why do I hear water? Oh, right. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> as soon as this finished, I just thought about the entire situation. Like, everyone was like, oh, hey, go battle your rival and stuff. And I was like, okay, yeah, I, I thought about it, like the entire situation. I was drinking water. I was like, and just started laughing. And this is terrible. Never think of anything when you're drinking water. I started drinking water, and I just started laughing. You can pretty much guess what happened next. I started, like, coughing, and uh, a few minutes of, like, coughing and laughing with the water. I choked, so I started spitting up water all over. And, you know what? I should check this right now. Uh, looking around. No, nope. okay, good. I just wet my pants, that's all. <laughs> I didn't, like, you know like piss my pants it's just i was spewing water and coughing and all my recording equipment is like right here so it was either get my computer wet or soak my pants so i just pointed down and coughed up all the water on my pants which are soaked kind of well not that soaked oddly i draw really fast but like the side of my chair is all ew so after this recording, I just felt I had to tell you guys that immediately. I tweeted about it. Not that everybody follows my tweeter. My tweeter. So, yeah. <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, that's that's a thing. <coughs> Alrighty. Um, since we just had one epic battle of ultimate destiny and showdown and things like that. Oh, man. I really coughed a lot. Like, you guys ever had that cough that just exhausts you? I'm not even sure why I'm recording now. Like, you're not supposed to record after a cough. That's probably going to insinuate another cough. Heh. Oh, bring a fourth. Bring a fourth. Another cough. Well, it's okay with me. I'm cool with that. I'm pretty sure I can hold out for, like, a little bit longer. Plus, it's like, if you know, if I don't record today, I'll just, like... When I was starting out recording, it would always be like... Uh, blah 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 and blah happened today. I don't want to record now. Well, dude, life doesn't stop because one thing happened. You just keep going and going and going. And let's just look at my teammates, I guess. Shame is modest. That's cool. <coughs> Mo you can have to excuse my cough. I <coughs> yeah, you can have to excuse that. Let's see, Reg Ice. Ah, the brave Reg Gigas. Ah, the hardy shiny metagross. I am so transferring some of these awesome dudes to my personal files. Anyways, um, so we are here in Pewter City, and in Pewter City, we're going to probably battle Steven Stone. I'm hoping we can battle him. Uh, if, if possible, we're going to battle Steven Stone. If not possible, uh, I have a backup. I had a backup. Just going to save the game right here. <clears throat> uh, although I might, like, normally I think he would be really strong, but I think I got this because Daiga kind of owns rock and steel types, and that's pretty much what his team consists of. I've heard you're an impeccable trainer, and I'd like to give you a gift. Before I do that, though, I don't suppose you'd be able to show me a Trico Hunter Bar. Ah! <laughs> I just remembered I didn't get, like, my file. I lost it when I got those starters, so I have to go do that starter thing, and then I get to battle Steven. Yeah! Uh, if you guys have been watching for a while, you'll know that, but if you didn't, I just chose to that. Oh, jeez. I am just very grateful that, although I choked, for one, uh, I survived choking. Not that, uh, I don't know, like, you never think you're going to die from choking, but, you know, it happens. So, uh, one, I'm grateful that, but I choked on water, so what are the chances I would die from that? <laughs> uh, you never know, I guess. Uh, I guess, where's the freaking mudkip? Awesome, mudkip. I'm just happy my equipment's not wet and stuff. I would literally cry if, like, I fried my technology while choking on water and just coughing it all up at my tech. Like, who would point in the direction of that? I pointed it at the wall. And, you know, in hindsight, that's probably not the smartest idea. There's, like, an electrical outlet right next to me. So I might have fried myself if by some chance there was saliva and it would stick from my tongue to the outlet. And Yeah. Anyways. Wait, what? Wait, what? Huh? Yes. Y okay. It, I have... Oh, right. It has to be in the front of my slot party. I'm like, what? <laughs> I do have the mud of Kips, dude. <laughs> I, 
I totally have the Kip of Muds. Yes, yes, yes. Give me the Pokemons. Yay! We got a Trico and a Torchic. And the weird thing is, I don't think he'll let you nickname them, which is odd. So now we're going to go back to the Pokemon Center. Oh, a little adorable Muddy Kip. Mud Kip is looking down steadily. I'm not sure why. Huh. I guess I technically just used Water Gun. <coughs> I don't ever think I want to use my water gun ever again. It's not a fun experience to tell you what. Water gunning. Not speed boost! Whoa! Uh -huh. That thing's overpowered. It's, um, that thing's overpowered. There's no overpowered ad. That thing's just freaking overpowered, dude. And why did I put it like in that box? Whatever, I'll put the mudkip in that box, too. <laughs> just go. G get out of here, you, you crazy mudkips. You crazy mudding of the kip. <laughs> Crazy mud kips. Uh, let's see here. <clears throat> also, just a reminder, because I gotta freaking put this in every video. Uh, live stream for the finale, in which I will try and do the boss rush, but I will definitely catch Arceus before that, so. And, you know, then I'll just take requests for a little bit. Um, that's on March 10th, so I really hope you guys tune in on that. And now we will battle Steven Stone. The. Actually, let's see, we've battled. Um, both the Kanto champions, blue and red, uh, Johto champion, I guess that's Lance, and we did battle him with his sister, I'm not sure if I would have to go do a rematch with him, but I'm probably not gonna do that, yeah, because I don't think Dre would have changed much for the rematches, I, I kind of don't think so, but if he did, I guess I'm an idiot, anyways, Steven, legendaries are incredible, I've been reading up on them with that book on my table, even as champion, I rarely get to see... It's such an interesting Pokemon. While, while you're here, would you consider a friendly battle? I probably should have saved before battling him, but whatever. <coughs> okay, I'm ready to battle. I did not clear my throat in the slightest. Like, seriously, my throat is still as bad as it was eight seconds ago. But here we go. I really hope it is a sprite thing. Oh, I didn't do the verse Steven Stone sprite thing. Whatever. Ah, oh, look at him in his awesome suit. First Pokemon is Skarmory, level 80 fuck. 80 fuck. I really don't have much against this thing, so here we go. It's gonna rock it. Ah, no, it's faster than me, isn't it? Yeah, no, it's slower than me. Suck it. Totally worth it. I'm sorry. Okay, crap. I guess best I can do in this situation is Waterfall as it goes for- Oh, frick. Damn it. I gotta just spam this. It's not gonna really- Oh, wow, it's actually doing a lot of damage. Uh, no, he's more of a challenge than red. What the flip? He's more of a challenge than red. <laughs> okay, yeah, just take this and die. Please just die. I think Daiga's... No, is Daiga still here? Oh, okay, Daiga's still here. I got this. Ooh, Claydol is actually kind of tough. Uh, Toxic, because it's a psychic ground type Pokemon. Ouch. That was probably not my best idea. Let's see, psychic ground type. Come on. Yeah. Come on, dude. Yeah! Come on, my dude! Oh no! Wow, that actually did a lot more damage than I was anticipating because, you know, <laughs> it's Claydol. You don't expect major attack power from Claydol. Oh, hey guys, did you hear that I sweep with my physical Claydol the other day? Oh, wow, Jimmy, really? Yeah, it was choice bended too. I didn't even fit to set up or anything. I mean, Claydol's got such a massive attack power. Yeah, you never really hear that. If anybody physically sweeps with a Claydol, uh, kudos to you, good sir or madam, because. Wow, that's, that's impressive. Yes, I am cheaply just stalling the hell out of him. Yeah, I did that. Next Pokemon is Bastiodon, a rock steel type. I'm just gonna go for hypnosis. Friggin' put it to sleep. God damn it. Go to sleep. How did its earthquake miss? I mean, I got bright powder, but that's... Wow. That's rather impressive. Let's go for extra sensory. It's my most powerful attack. Oh my gosh, I miss having that attack I had. Let's go to Daiga. Yeah, he woke up, got me with earthquake. Doesn't actually do it much. Come on, Earthquake, kill it! Yeah! Woo! Does not have Sturdy in this generation. Sucks for it. I mean, it has Sturdy, but it's Sturdy isn't as Sturdy as you would think. Uh, whatever. Empoleon is up next. I'm gonna risk it and go for close <clears throat> combat. Surprisingly, that worked at all. God, I just opened a can of shit in my face. Like, really, this thing is faster than me now, isn't it? Oh, it's not. Okay. Whatever. Super effective. Oh, ho, ho, yes. Not really sure why I sacrificed Riley there. I'm overpowered! 
holy shit, I really am overpowered. I'm like, I'm screaming out, I'm overpowered. Like, he's like, what? How are you winning? And I'm just like, I'm overpowered. How'd you get here? I'm overpowered. What's your name? I'm overpowered. I just hit my desk like eight times. Oh, God, why? Earthquake might, actually, might not actually KO because that thing is really bulky. Citrus Berry Mash. Oh, God, there's no way Nell is going to pull this off. I'm going to max revive. I'm sorry, now for not believing in you this time, but statistically, not your most favorable matchup. Earthquake, ouch, yeah, I was really hoping he'd miss. Alright, and with this, we have defeated Steven Stone of the Hoenn, I guess he's just one of the champions, whatever. Hey, money, wait, did anybody have the amulet coin on? Please tell me you had the amulet coin on. Oh, that we didn't have the amulet coin on. <sighs> whatever an expert performance if I do say so myself tell me if you want to have another go I can battle him for wow well that's pretty dangerous like he just pummel me for an endless amount of time okay so we got the whole in starters again because <clears throat> the file was corrupted last time and we defeated Steven Stone and I choked I thought the choking part was the second most interesting the first was the battle uh, I'd probably lose the battle. Technically, yeah, Steven would have kicked my butt without items. Like, if I can't beat somebody without items, I don't think I can really beat them. Which means, like, I can't beat half the game. But still, regardless of that. Question of the day is, what do you think of Steven Stone? I think he is... Next to Alder? Maybe above Alder? Like, if you've seen Alder from the anime, you're just like, Oh my gosh, Alder is Jiraiya. I fucking love Alder now. He's awesome. Like, literally, Jiraiya, Alder, pretty much the same, except for, like, a few things. But they're so similar. Just go watch them in the anime of Pokemans. They're really similar. Anyways, question of the day is, what do you think of Steven Stone? He is probably my favorite champion ever. Like, Wallace can go get humped by a skitty or something. Get it? Because he's got a Waylord. And Cynthia is okay. She's really tough and fun to battle, but Steven just looks cool. And red's okay too. I know, I know. Red's not your favorite. What's wrong with you? It's just red is so classic. It's like, who doesn't like red? But Steven, he's just my favorite. Uh, yeah. Am I forgetting a champion? Red, Cynthia. Oh, Lance. I don't really see Lance as a champion, more like an end game person you just fight. Like, a champion is super strong, like 70s range. Like, they get there to their 70s range. Wallace has never gotten to the 70s range. And I don't think Lance gets to 70s unless you rematch him. But Steven is 70s in one game before you battle him or anything. Cynthia is 70s in, like, I think, like, every game she premieres in that's not the Sinnoh region games. Red is definitely in the 70s. And I've ranted for too long. Anyways, that's the question of the day. Remember to leave a like, a comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. Bye!